Welcome to Luxuriously Poor, and thank you for stopping by, and I hope all of you are having a great day. Now, I made this video around July 4th. They have these chicken leg quarters on sale for two seventy something and I bought 20 pounds. I bought two bags of them, and I wanted to show you how I cook them, and I also want to just discuss how poor of a quality of the food we are getting now. I used to pay these for a dollar ninety something and they were never this bad of a quality. When you go to look at the leg and the thigh, you'll notice on the thigh that it has the little tail end to it, plus the back, part of the back, which is quite a bit of it is the back. And that means you're getting an enormous amount of bone. And if you look at the chicken, the thigh has hardly any meat on it. Used to, they were big and meaty, and they're not anymore. Our food quality has really, really gotten bad. Now, that's why I don't buy them when they charge $8 a bag. I don't think it's worth $8 a bag. It's too much money for poor quality, skinny little legs with hardly any meat on them at all. This one doesn't even have a thigh to it. It's just the leg, and you will get that a lot. But anyhow, I'm going to cook these on the grill. I'm going to do them two different ways. This saves you a lot of money on gas in the house, and it also saves you a lot of heating up of your house. This is a pizza pan. I threw all 10 pounds in there. I cut the leg from the thigh. Season them, season them the way you want. I actually seasoned each pan differently. This pan I seasoned with salt, onion powder, garlic powder, black pepper, and that's I think that's about it. Just a few seasonings, and I put nothing. I just threw the chicken legs in there and threw them on the grill. The grill was already heated. My nutter butter starts to grill for me. He doesn't do the cooking. I do the cooking, but he starts the fire for me. This is the first pan. Oh, is it smell delicious. And I'm kidding you not. It's absolutely delicious. Now, why am I cooking all this? Because I can pull this meat off the bone and I can make all kinds of things from even... Oh, chicken salad sandwiches with just chicken oh, from a grill is awesome. Now here's the second pan. I'm going to line this because I hate the wash and the cleanup many times things stick really bad and so I'm putting aluminum foil on this. Now I've already done this and I can tell you I don't like it. I do not like this aluminum foil. Okay? But I won't do it again. I wanted to see how it worked. And so I lined the aluminum foil, and I'm going to season them with kicking chicken from Weber. This kicking chicken stuff on chicken is extremely good. I really like this spice for the chicken. Now, this is the second bag. The sec this is, you know, the, the, uh, I bought two 10-pound bags, and I'm going to actually put a lid on top of this one. This is another thing. The chicken leg thighs and quarters used to be very, very tender. They're not anymore. They're very tough. Um, I know the reason why, but that's, uh, for, that's for another video. They're not really butchering and selling the chickens that they originally sold to us. They had to uh, supply us with a different type of chicken. There was a problem with the chicken that they used to sell to us. But that's another story for another day. So I'm going to put the lid on top of this when I put this on the grill. Because it will hold some of the moisture in there which will help it to steam the meat first. And by doing that it really does tenderize it. Oh, man does this stuff smell delicious. And it is. It's, it's absolutely delicious. I have this and I'm going to be able to pull this meat off the bone or leave it on the bone and I can make tacos, I can make burritos, I can make sandwiches. Oh, I'm putting a lid back on this. And I will keep cooking this until it's completely done and nice and tender. And this is a wonderful 
inexpensive, carefree way to cook a whole lot of chicken and put it in your freezer and not have to worry about it. You take it out whenever you need it. Well, God bless. <laughs>